I tore down my white cloud mountain minnow breeding tub yesterday, so I thought I'd let you know about the results. It's going to be a short video because sadly there's nothing to report. I set up the tub on my back deck in late June using a 20 gallon plastic utility bin. I installed a sponge filter and filled the tub with a variety of stem plants and floating plants. I chose five white cloud mountain minnows from my display aquarium, two males and three females, and placed them in the tub. Around mid-July, I spotted three fry swimming near the surface. That was promising and I got my hopes up. But by early August, that number was down to two. So to be safe, I scooped them out and brought them indoors to grow out in my 10 gallon quarry tank. By mid-August, there were still no additional fry appearing in the tub. I removed the stem plants and added two large bunches of java moss as well as four acrylic spawning mops. Still no fry appeared. In early September, I gave up and removed the adults because I've been anxious to start an indoor breeding experiment using a false bottom arrangement. I was hoping a few more fry might hatch out after the adults were gone, but none appeared. It was kind of sad to empty the tub and spend hours cleaning up and putting stuff away after such dismal results. The two juveniles are now big enough to live in my display tank. It feels pretty pathetic since I was hoping to add one or two dozen to the population. If this basket technique doesn't yield results, I'm going to throw in the towel, at least for now. I obviously don't have the breeding equivalent of a green thumb. Thanks for watching, good luck with your projects, and I'll see you in the next video.